Welcome back to day four of the Australasian FSA competition at Winton Motorsport Raceway. Today we have the autocross and the endurance events. Are you ready? With a real change in the weather from the heat of yesterday. The morning started with rain on the horizon for the autocross event, with many teams scrambling to fit wet tyres to go out for their first runs. The event cleared halfway through though, with most teams getting a quick run in on their dry tyres. Munich topped the charts in autocross with a 119.16, closely followed by Monash Combustion with a 119.29, although I believe there was a number of cones on that run. Monash Electric came in third with a 119.78, and then there was an over three second gap back to the next closest competitor, Canterbury Combustion with a 123.4. This was a great result for the Monash Electric car, which weighed in at 274 kilos, so to be within 0.6 in a second of the Munich Electric car is a great achievement for the team. Thanks for Curtin for providing me with the onboard footage from their autocross run. Curtin run a CVT Yamaha phaser engine, uh, which you can hear distinctively through the engine note during the run. Endurance started with light rain, with Munich, Monash Electric, Monash Combustion and Canterbury all going out on slicks. The weather quickly deteriorated into worsening rain, with most teams changing to their wet tyres during the driver change. Interestingly, Monash changed to a 13 inch Goodyear wet tyre, where they previously ran 10s. Munich attempted to change to their wet tyres, but due to running the heat of their hub, did not allow them to remove their carbon rim from the spigot. Munich managed a 126 before the rain slowed them down, finishing up in the 140s in the heavy rain on their slick tyres. The rain cleared during the middle of endurance, with some of the later running teams having a much drier track. Wollongong, Sophia and RMIT Electric all reaching 123s.
test track. There is a number of failures during the endurance event. With one of the most significant, a wheel centre failure in the RMIT combustion car. I do hope they share some spectacular slow motion footage which they managed to capture as this happened on track. The final results for the competition in the electric class were Munich first, Monash second and Rockland third. And in the combustion class, Monash was first, UNSW, University of New South Wales went second and AFC, which is Edith Cowan University, came in third.